hello and welcome back to the another video of the java tutorial series so today we are covering the remaining types of inheritance that is hierarchical inheritance and we'll see why the multiple inheritance is not supported in java okay so let me get into my ide i will create one new class name hierarchical inheritance inheritance Okay, and let me increase my font size. I will include the main method. Okay, so what is hierarchical inheritance is when two or more classes inherits a single class. Means let's suppose uh, one class A is there and whose properties are getting inherited by the cla two classes that is class B and class C at the same time. In the example, uh, we'll see one example. Let, let's just get started. I will create one class name as animal and inside that I will create one method which it doesn't return anything that is void it and this method doesn't accepting any parameters and I will simply print eating these are some uh, simple examples to under just to understand uh, what is hierarchical inheritance we will cover uh, a complex example in our upcoming videos also and another one is class dog which is extending the class animal and inside this I will create another uh, let's suppose what dog does bark I'll create one method name as bark and I'll simply print barking okay uh, and one more class is required uh, let's suppose class cat and this class is also extending animal class and inside this I will create one more method name is meow uh, which doesn't accept any parameter and inside this I will write Meowing, M-E-O-W-I-N-G, meowing. Okay, so our goal is to achieve hierarchical inheritance here. Uh, let's suppose this is the parent class. I will write one comment over here. Parent class, and this doc class is the child class one, and this is child class 2 okay and inside this I will write now I will write my main method now let me copy this from here and I will paste it over here my main method okay and inside my main method I will create uh, one object of the cat class cat c is equals to new cat okay and i will i will call wait a minute why i'm getting error i cannot be referenced from a static const text wait a minute uh, let me get let me write it as static all static because we are calling them inside a static method okay so that's why I'm getting one error I will let all yeah. ah, yes right now ah, yes okay and I will call C dot meow and again C dot eat because it is inheriting the properties of the animal class and eat method is written inside the animal class so that we can call that eat method using the object of the cat and now I will write one more line here but I'm commenting out initially and I will write sorry not eat bark mm, okay and now if I run this the expected output should be uh, meowing and eating let's see 
here you can see me having an 18 is getting printed on the console and now if I comment remove this comment and if I try to run this here you can see it it's giving me error because location variable C is type hierarchical interest dot cat and it, it is telling me that this is compile time error guys I will uh, commit it out CT error means compile time error this error occurs because we uh, here you can see we are in this is the parent class animal class and this is the cat and dog class these are the child classes which are inheriting the properties of this and we are extend this is this is the cat class and we are extending the, extending the properties of the a class there is no linking between the class c and class b and we are trying to access the methods which are written inside the class b using the object of the class c that is not possible here that's why uh, java is throwing errors uh, compile time error this is this can not be done inside java okay i will comment it out and i will run uh, run it again now it's working fine okay i hope you guys understood the hierarchical inheritance in java and now let's talk about why multiple inheritance is not supported in java so in multiple inheritance is what here you can see one two parent class one one class is there which is child class which is inheriting the properties of the two different parent classes in class a and class b are the parent classes and class c is a child class and class c is trying to inherit the properties of the class a as well as the class b at the same time okay uh, this is not supported in java uh, why so to reduce the complexity and simplify the language multiple inheritance is not supported in java uh, i will give give you one scenario where a a b and c are the three classes here you can see and class C is inherit inherit the property of the class A and B. If class A and B have the same methods and you call it from the child class object, means class, let's suppose one method is there, void eat, and in class A as well as the class B, and we are trying to call the this void eat method inside class C, this creates an ambiguity uh, for the class C to, to whom the call, uh, which class method should it call class, whether, whether the class a and class b since the compile time errors are better than the runtime errors java renders the compile time error if you inherit the two classes okay so whether you have the same method or the different method there will be the compile time error so to remove this ambiguity java doesn't support multiple inheritance but there is a way you can achieve multiple inheritance in java that is using in interfaces uh, we will cover interfaces in our upcoming videos when we will be talking about the polymorphism in java so right now uh, just understand that multiple entities is not supported in java just to simplify the language and remove the ambiguity which is created here java doesn't support multiple inheritance so thank you guys for watching this video i'll see you in the next one